Hola, Green Mountain Maniac with another successful hackery. This is the remote drive, the drive unit for the coax switch. I have a coax switch here in the southeast corner of the basement. I moved the shack about a month ago, three weeks ago or so, uh, into the northwest corner of the basement. And uh, I got looking at remote coax switches and I got thinking, hey, uh, why not use the Alpha Delta I have, seeing as how uh, uh, the like the MFJ switches, the port to port isolation is horrific on those things. And if you want a decent switch, you got to spend at least 400 bucks. So uh, 12 dollars, you're gonna love this. So this is a 2 RPM motor, and just basically built a bracket out of strapping to clamp the motor onto. And this right here, the white thing right there is in the center, that's the coupler. That's a three quarter inch PVC end cap. And I used a Dremel tool, uh, created a flat side to it, drilled out a hole, left the side of it flat and it slips on to friction fits onto the drive shaft of the motor. Turns very, very slowly. Let me see if I can get around here. So there you go. And then I router out the channels. Router out the channels on the um, PVC end cap to slip down over the switch. Now you want to leave a little bit of space because the switch raises up as it switches positions. Uh, unbelievable. It works awesome. Awesome. Run into the shack here and uh, run into the shack and uh, demonstrate it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to run through a demo on the switch, uh, listening to Oscar November 4 Tango Whiskey Sierra Stroke Portable on 2635, 20 meters. And uh, what I'll do is I'll step through the antennas using the remote switch. Uh, this is the remote switch right here, made. This is basically a reverse circuit right here. This is going up, flipped forward. This goes from 1 to 4, going up. Flip back goes four to one, up and down basically. This is uh, on off to the motor drive. So uh, position four, uh, position four will be is what it's currently on. That's 20 meter delta. Uh, that's a 20 meter monoband delta loop. And then position three, I'll step down to is the 20 meter, 17 meter hex beam. And then we'll be in neutral position. And then we'll move from there down to position two, which is the 40 meter delta loop parasitic array. And then the Cobra Senior at position one. So here we go. Okay, 20 meter delta loop monobander to hex beam. Okay, this is going to neutral. Neutral position. Okay, we're going to position two, which is the 40 meter parasitic ray. There's position two. Going to the Cobra, here we go. There's the Cobra, senior. And there you go. Neato! She works. Anyways, hope you enjoyed it. Give you some ideas to save yourself a few hundred dollars. Um, works great. The only thing I'm planning on doing is I'm going to construct an LED system and run a Cat5 out there, carry all the signals through a Cat5 cable, um, and put four LEDs into this little box, probably stuck right in the front here and it'll be uh, antennas one through four so if i walk out of the shack and i forget where i'm at uh, the minute i turn on the power supply the leds will light wherever the antenna is switched to and i know how to do that i just got to put like a uh, 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 energize a single contact on the switch and and uh, either i don't know i'll epoxy that on or, or do something put a sm very small set screw in there um, 
and then uh, a series of tabs uh, across the switch as it rolls across it will make contact for the associated antenna uh, giving me an LED telling me that it's on there that's really the only thing left to do and I'll do that some days uh, 7-3 hope you enjoyed it K1GMM